add a custom drawing that you've made or animated lines and shapes to your Instagram Reels videos like this. Don't know how? That's what this video is here for. Let me show you. Now to add a simple custom drawing to your Instagram Reels video, all you need is your iPhone Notes app. Once you're in there, then you can write or draw. You need to cut it out using this tool and then you copy and then paste into your Instagram Reels video. You can also add a custom sticker or cutout of a photo or video in your camera roll on the iPhone. All you need to do is find the image you want, long press and tap and hold on the area that you want to cut out. There'll be like a shine or a glow effect. It will then say copy, tap copy, go over to your Instagram Reels, go to text and paste it into your Instagram Reels video. If you want to add and create a custom animation effect for your Instagram Reels video, you're going to need either additional app or software that allows you to export as a .gif or GIF file format. I personally use Procreate on the iPad so I can use my Apple Pencil, but I know you can use Canva, which is free. You can use Procreate on your phone, um, which is about five pound from the App Store, or you can subscribe to something like Adobe where you can use Photoshop. I'm gonna show you the way that I think is easiest to get these animated lines and shapes into your Instagram Reels videos using Procreate. Okay, here I'm gonna import my picture into Procreate. I'm gonna add a new layer and then I'm gonna draw on that new layer on top of the photo or image that I just imported. Every time you want a change or a movement, create another layer. For something simple, you only need between five and six frames because this is gonna loop and repeat. So for this, I just drew around the subject in Procreate, make sure animation is turned on. Now, as you can see, there's the timeline at the bottom. So any layers that you now have that are turned on will appear in order from bottom to top. And this will appear in the timeline. If you want to adjust the timing, you can do this by tapping settings and choosing your frames or frame rate. And then once you're done, you tap the spanner, select share, export as animated GIF or .gif. So it is now in your camera roll. Make sure it's set to transparent. It's just in your reels, add text, go to your camera roll, copy the image, go to text, paste the image, and there it will appear. And you might have to do this by pinching and rotating until you have positioned it the way you want. Now you've watched this tutorial and you've got the hang of this technique, you can now start to get really creative with the videos that you make and the animations that you add into those videos. I hope you found that this tutorial helpful. If you did, don't forget to tapity tap tap that like button. I've got lots more videos on the way, so make sure you're subscribed. I'm Ray, this is Simply Create. Thank you for watching. Peace.